his policy, we might get to see it. Or actually, he became poor to see his policy, we might get to see it. He takes that one off and don't put it to the rest of the church. He says, people are going to take it. He's a pretty poor guy. He's a good 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 guy. Yes, by revelation of the Holy Ghost, more instruction is given to the church. Right here. Bread to the evil. Feed to the soul. And multiply to eat stone. That is an action to make it to sow. If you don't sow it, you can multiply it. If it's not sown, it's not multiplied. You understand? He didn't say he gave bread to the eater and feed to the sower and multiply it in his own seed. Why? He didn't work that way. Right at the very beginning, he's down to all the seeds on the harvest of the people. He got to the Genesis. There is an action to make it to the sun. And there's so many people trying to find out how to get around that. Yeah, I found him to pretty straight and easy to deal with. He said, You show me your faith without your acceptance, without your action. I'll show you my faith to find my action. And so they were like, he has to see, I have given him the man and he has done the man. This is the reason why I'm talking about the man. And it takes part of a, of a revelation. It was taking a scripture in the New Testament. And they went up with it and I go to bed at him. Like this one. And they run off for going anything else that's in the limits of that scripture in the New Testament. They were wearing it to the to this city, Derby City, the market. Like this. Like that. 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 And they saw that Satan had a significant and deep need for the Lord. So there's a mother's womb who had never walked. Now, that's what I mean. Those are born to it. Some say after childbirth or all this and that. You don't know. <laughs> but he crippled it. He didn't get crippled. He never walked. The same Lord Paul speaks. He stood fast with the holy man and his seed. 
then you have faith to be healed. I'm going to tell you, you've got faith to be healed. I'm going to tell you, you've got faith to be healed. I got faith to leave. May God name me and I have this or whatever. Um, I mean, I believe the things that are That's why we have faith. That's why we have faith. 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 And he leaped and walked. In other words, here's the guy who got the faith to be here. He stood for God. The minute he acted on what he believed, he received the result of what he was going to do. Amen. Amen. Now, when Jesus saw the call, he wanted to do because the Lord said, Can you see the Lord? That's why. Come down upon him and then he came down. And the light was coming in. And of course, they had to stop that whole thing. So the point is this here's a man who has heard the gospel preached, called for peace in his family by reason of the Holy Ghost, that he had faith to be healed. I will, you will, you will. You know, think of Elijah who said that. You wouldn't even have that story in the Bible, and then I'm glad you said that. Because the Bible says he first had his first, and he didn't even know it, and that he was the Lord who came upon him, and he did not know what he was doing. It wasn't until he started that the hand of the Lord came on him. Amen? I love this because you have to ask the of that. It's not that long ago, but it's years ago. But Jericho walked, if you've seen those in the movies, with the walls, the fire, and those big boulders, and the children of Israel coming in there, dodging into these boulders, you know, trying to get in there, you know, and there's all kinds of disasters on them. My God, you said that's why. The walls of the city are there. They're standing there and saying, and the outer walls are lower than the city. Trying to get people on the outer line. Now, now, if they're going to take the city, and then the walls fall over, and there's big boulders there, and all this kind of stuff, there's going to be a lot of people taking the land. But they just went down there, they just went right up on top of it. Hallelujah. But notice, this whole thing, this whole thing started out with the Lord saying, I've given you the city, I've given you the kingdom, I've given you the land you need. It gives you two guys to do God says, I healed your body. I delivered you from Satan and darkness. I saved your soul. I did what you got to do. I prospered you. I did what you got to do. My faith is special. It's one of these areas I would just let go up and come and see the body. I don't know if I need somebody in my life. I don't have to do anything. I don't have to do anything. I don't have to do anything. I 
don't have to do that. I don't have to do that. I don't have to do that. I don't have to do that. They don't have to do that. And God's going to talk to them. God's going to get them. And they're going to get them. And they're going to get them. And that's what we do. You're going to fight for you, not to do God's good for you. Yeah, it's because the Lord will do for you, not to do it for you, not to do it for you. Yeah. Did I believe it in the middle of time? He gave you the bread to proceed to pray. He fed you by the way to fight for you. And if you ate the seed, that's when you fought. Amen. Why do you think you get bread and you get a piece of salt? To sustain you until you're going to put harvest on you. He can sustain you while you're waiting for harvest. Now that bread, yeah, I'm going to give you the food, I'm going to sustain you until you get the harvest, and I'm going to multiply the harvest. We got bread ready to eat the food. And then to that faith in God, the blessed of my kids, Jimmy, who told you to? You go around confessing. I don't have to do it, and I don't have time, I don't have to do it. That's what you call it. No, that's not. That's faith without work. And that's what I have to do. And you've done it. I like faith to give you a step one. But they need to say, uh, it's a song to see. But it's the same thing. See, we have much of my stuff. It's more than we started it. All right? How do I get this this morning? That's the truth of all of us. I don't have that expression. I don't know that. But I am having fun straight away. Glory to God. Now, the people went in. And then they were reminded, Shout for the Lord to be your seed. And so they did it, and they took the seed. But it went straight up, and immediately they went over the water and took the seed. I'm sorry. He wakes out salvage. Heard the sound of the trumpet. He could tell the great shout, but all fell down flat. So the people went up into the city, and then straight before him, You know, today I began having, you know, um, house prayer meetings at the Joshua Creek on Sunday. He said, Lord, give me the city. Maybe he's giving me the kingdom. He's giving me the mighty men. Now we're going to march around the city six times. Don't step there. We're going to march seven times. Don't step. We're going to step. We're going to come. We're going to go in and take the city. The Lord, give us it. And I'm going to give you God's kingdom. But the Lord don't give me because you don't need to give me that. People have to keep the people not to be in the John Peter because they keep the people calm while they get out there and pray. That was crazy. Anyway, all right, I better move on. <laughs> all right, let's go to Luke chapter 5. You see, you know, I'm trying not to get hung up on some of the things, but you see right in that story an account where John. He had already given to the city of David, and he took it back what he had already done. In order to what he had already done, he did the opposite. The city had already given to him. But then he said, Now, I'm going to give it to you. He used the word, but, 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 
can really put in there. You can see that we put in the real life. Oh, really? Yeah, I believe you do. And if you can see the right? So you got to see the you got to see it. You can't do it because there's nothing to do. The Bible says that God is a robot. Amen? So you can't go, well, I believe, you know, God said, I'm going to go to the Bible. You can do it because you can't do it. You can do it because you can't do it. You can you're trying to figure out good, turn them, and, and get my check for $4,500 going down the bank, write the check for $500 and get me $500 from here. That's how we get $500. Right? 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 It's a weird world. It's not like that way. No. And so you sit and sit and try to check the world. And it's all right now until you get beyond the time. And that's the point. People have the right heart. So people think I'm tired of just looking at these people just wallowing in the mud. Okay, what's that mean? It came back to certain days, he took the day, took the seat, got to the Lord, came back. 
they may do it. Young doctors. Young believers. If you're even talking about the Bible, being a spectator is not an afternoon to say. And then, this man, if he's got a thing that he could get, he could get the thing that they could get this guy, he'll be here. They show up to me and they can't get him. There's no way to even get to him. But their faith says, we said, if we can get to Jesus, I have it now, I have it now. Believe this because what they did, their actions had to be a representation of what they were believing in faith. Their actions lead them to Jesus, he'll get healed. When they got there, they couldn't get to Jesus. But their faith was, if we can get into him, we'll get him healed. So when you strike them down, I'm in the group, lift the group up, and drop them down in the middle. They just said, we're not going to be down. And Jesus and the Bible said, saw their faith. Now, you know, the poor guy's doing his no part, and the guy on the stretch, he's got some faith in it. If he's got some faith, he's going to tell them, don't you tell me that, Dad. Come on, man, God, I'm going to go through. Come on, man. What's wrong with you? You're going to go through. You can't tell me that you have to get something over here. You have to get something over here. You have to get something over here. Now, I'm not going to say, right? The guy is taking the rest of the guy on the stretcher. Amen. And when they say, he's just coming out to the roof, the Bible says, Jesus saw their faith. And they were reacting to their faith. Or they were acting because of their faith. Kind of drama in the French drama is coming on here. But, you know, they were acting based on their faith. Their faith produces action. That's what James is talking about when he says, You say you have faith without works. I show you my faith by my works. Or, look for by the law. The actions that I take are a corresponding result to what I believe. Now, I'm not trying to ask it to prove to me what I believe. My belief moves me to do certain things. Now, let's just face it. There are a lot of Muslims in the world who are more committed to their belief system than Christians. They blow themselves up with China or Singapore. They fly planes into the building, call it Al-Aqsa, al They, um, the religion that knows that, they go to anything in the world to kill people. They're in their church. So they believe in Jesus, they say. In church, here, and whatever, they believe they're going to get 40 words in front of that church. They just don't know that 40 minutes stop them. Yeah, I've seen that come up real quick, but I'm going to say something. This is the truth. This is the truth. You know, you know, somebody just looked at me and told me, Terry, I said, Here, these are the 40 versions. And there's 40 million to start to them. <laughs> oh, well. Hallelujah. No one would doubt. But they're more committed. See, they, they, they act on their belief system. Christians need to be honest with people in what they believe. You see, you know, we got so, so many about what we don't have to do. And what we've done is we've taken the works-based belief system we had 50, 70 years ago that is, you know, uh, uh, effective on many of us. We do that to that extent. The uh, polar that they get, the twin towers of Western Armenia, the Boko Haram, and the Armenian boy, as I'm here to do, somebody walks up here and knocks me off the stool, and I said, that's where I get Jesus coming to church right now. I'm going to church. Because I was in this house that was in the Twin Towers. And then you got the South that the Twin Towers come in. So it don't matter what you do, once you get saved, you're going to heaven. You can go, you can go up the World Trade Center 14 times a day. You can drop a nuclear bomb on every nation. And uh, if you just don't like the way they do it, and you're going to heaven because you're saved. No matter what. No such thing. Okay. But the fact of the matter is, I had a point that we have to be changing the system. Sin is not going to save us personally. And I believe part of it's because some people try to export what they have instead of import it. The truth is, you got to be proud of that. Because they have to be able to have copies. Because today, 
get it. You have to have to get to that. Don't ever try to export what you have to see that today. You'll get caught.
way too much fun either. Hello? 
take them in place of the church. It doesn't look like you guys are going to be the You need to send a great deal of all the money. I'm going to send a great deal of money. If you don't buy it, you don't buy it. You send it, but if you don't buy it, you don't buy it. How are you going to do it? I'm going to send it to the world. 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 I'm going to send it Faith is telling you what to do. Faith is saying, you believe this is going to do this. You believe this is going to do this. And you believe this. I'm going to credit you know this picture. I'm going to get you to take it. So now, but, um, you know, there's other people. Luke 17, there's the 10 lepers. Uh, Mark 10. Man, Jesus, I told David, I'm going to get him over here to show you. He said, I'm going to put the baby there. That's part of my salvation. I can't just send you to Jesus. You need to 